last poem, but before I do, again, thank you for listening. And I do have my, co uh, my co copies of my book for sale in the back. And I'm also handing out personalized bookmarks with a quote from my book. So come check it out or just come talk to me. It's cool. <laughs> so this is my last poem. You. Your lungs still breathe my name, and I'm counting 374 different ways to say I love you. There are 374 letters being passed between the dust particles under my toes, and, and you wonder how something so insignificant like dust can ever fade in oblivion. In another universe, my nails are painted red, like the color of your bedroom walls, and I tell you red is my favorite color. I don't have much of a wishbone anymore, but it's 12 or 1 a.m. I'm sleeping on your wooden floors, hair tangled with harlequin memories, and your dust fingers are chasing promises along the wreck map of my skin, but, but they say nothing good happens after midnight. Your dust is slowly fading. Maybe if I stay awake, you won't disappear. Maybe if I strip your eyelids, I can make my way inside the globe of your eyeballs and spin forever so no matter where I go, you will be there. And maybe I can construct my legs into training wheels. That way, I can always learn my way back to you. Maybe this is my way of not being ready to lose myself. My mind is holding restraining orders against my dreams. And tonight, under a field of stars, and a room filled with your dust, these these drunken fingers are writing about you. You. It's past midnight. You will soon melt within the sky, streaming the stars beside you. This soul is hanging itself in the back of your closet, making conversation with the shadows or skeletons left behind. Time is inevitable. And soon it will shock you under the chimes of every tick-tock and unleash you in an empty void where we shall never meet. But, but know this. There is a sound in my veins that is only heard through the vibrations of your oxygen. And there is a link bridge to my heart that is hammered with the needles of your edges. There are particles dancing in my bones that once made love to you. And there are molecules swimming in my fluid that once swam with you. Know this. Tonight, the world may be coming to an end. There are caterpillars crawling behind your elbows, and there are ants making their way to the roof of your toes. Your eyeballs are empty sockets. You are dirt and soil and everything that keeps vanishing. And here I am, bloodshot eyes and vodka-filled throats. You grab each one of my features like snowflakes. You tell me about impermanence as they slowly fade through your fingers and it's past midnight. The world is coming to an end. But believe that there are enough galaxies inside us so we do not. And know this, you do not need me. But believing that you do does not make you weak. There is a world that is coming to an end. But I will keep coming back to you. Know this, I will keep coming back to you. Thank you so much.